you speaking about your fears is really important for people to hear. It's important for everyone listening. It's also important for your counterparts to hear that because we all have them. And it's not something a lot of people ask us about. What are you fearful of in your job? Um, they always talk about how you got there or how you, you know, what do I need to do to be there? But they don't talk about what it's like residing in that space in your career, right? For me, coming into this industry, I still know, I feel like I don't know anything about television. I'm just on it. And so I don't have that personality. I don't have that, you know, I'm very, very different, I think, than how people assume you are because you're on, on television. And for me, one of the biggest fears every year, you know, you live contract to contract and you have a three-year contract. And then in the, in the third year of your contract, you're freaking out about if you're going to have a job in the next year, because you've, you've not had a contract renewed before. And as a woman, for me, one of the biggest fears that I faced this entire time of starting when I was like 25, 26 is eventually I'm going to, I'm going to be too old and not look good enough to do this job. And that's what people are looking at. That's what people are judging me on. And I was genuinely fearful about what is my life going to be after I've aged out of being okay as a woman to be on camera. And I don't know if anyone else has experienced that. And it wasn't until I actually got this job in the booth that for the first time I felt a little bit of safety. Cause I'm like, you know, Jerry Reynolds who did this job for, for decades before Doug Christie took it over, um, who is who I replaced when he went to coaching. Men do this job until they're 70, 75, sometimes 80 year olds are, you know what I mean? They're working. And I'm like, I finally feel a little bit of safety, but the fear never really goes away. And so I applaud you for speaking about fears because I think everyone needs to recognize that. That is a really big thing in this industry. There's a lot of fear, not a lot of people talk about it. 